Hey, what is up guys? It's Vinny Designs here. Welcome back to another Affinity Publisher beta tutorial. And in this video, we are going to be learning about master pages and how to set them up and how to edit them. So a master page, uh, we can create them in the left column and we have the uh, drop down menu for master pages. And to add a new page, you can either right click and add a master spread or use this icon to create a new master page. And we can give it a name. Let's give it master A. Now, again, it gives us the option to choose single page or facing. We have the document laid out as facing, so we will say facing. And then that's pretty much it. If you want to customize it further, you can do that as well. Edit your margins, bleed. I just click OK. And you can see that we have a master page set up. The great thing about master pages is that when you create something in this master page, uh, let's say we add a background to this. We can just choose this rectangle, drag it, click and drag. And let's go to the color menu and we can just give it a color. Let's just give it a, I don't know, a light gray color. Uh, maybe we can make it a bit darker so that you can see the difference. Um, so we have this gray color and uh, right now you can see that it's not doing anything. It just has a gray background on this page. But if we were to select all these uh, additional pages that we have, the 12 pages. So you click on the first one, hold shift and then click on the last one so that you select all those pages right click and then apply master. Now what this will do is pretty much use the master A that we created with the gray background and apply it to all the 12 pages that we have set up. We can uh, set it to current spread, all pages, odd pages, even pages, specified pages, and uh, you can also replace existing pages. And we already have all of them selected so we don't need to uh, worry about this, but we can click OK and and now you can see that all the 12 pages have the same gray background as the master page. And we can do additional edits to the master page such as adding guides or uh, a grid layout system or page numbers and then it will apply directly to all these pages. If you want to edit the master page again, you can just go to the master A, right click and go to spread properties and then you can customize it from there again.